On Canal Street, those who wanted a good spot didn't arrive early Tuesday morning. They arrived Monday night, staking out the very best spots to celebrate Fat Tuesday. I enjoy feeding some of the people just passing by. You know, they stop and ask for a sandwich. Well, they, they ask to buy it, but I give it to them. Two of the biggest parades, Zulu and Rex, snake through the city from dawn until dusk. The massive crews with their floats and coveted trinkets are joined by smaller social clubs along the parade route. It transcends uh, sexes, racial barriers, and ages. It transcends every social strata to get to the root cause of the reason we're here, and that's the party. Fat Tuesday marks the final day of the Mardi Gras celebration. Rough estimates are some 800,000 people will take part in the citywide revelry. That would make this the biggest Mardi Gras since Hurricane Katrina ravaged New Orleans. But the darker days of the Big Easy are far from the minds of those who have come here to be a part of the once a year bash. You don't get this anywhere else, you know what I'm saying? They try to imitate a lot of other places, but it just isn't the same. It can be uh, imitated, but not duplicated, I always say. Meanwhile, crowds were already gathering on Bourbon Street. The party here will continue all day until police shut down the street at midnight. Jason Brown is the Associated Press, New Orleans.